Oh, don't mistake him for the lead singer of Train. <laughs> We're guessing that's happened before. <laughs> Michael Malone doesn't <laughs> sing, but he does have a mic in his hand a lot. He's done really well in stand-up. And then getting into film more and more. Michael Malone is back. Yeah. Michael. Hey. Oh, hey guys. Well, you were just telling me you were traveling over in Europe for a long time. Same yeah, time was, Kevin was I over was there. Yeah, I was just in uh, Brussels the same time Kevin was. Small he was world. talking about that, that sensation of coming home and just after the terrorist attack there. Yeah. Did you have that uh, experience, I had a, too? I had it in a... I had it in a different way. Mine was um, mine was over food. <laughs> <laughs> I miss the food. You miss so the food. Really? What did you like? What did you eat that you that knocked everything. your socks off? It, you know what? I had wild boar inside a castle what? in Germany. Was it good? It was really? amazing. And was so it? that's the thing. It's hard to come back to the United States and be like, let's go to Applebee's. <laughs> you know, it's like when, you, well, when somebody gives you boar in a, a castle, castle, you're like, well, what am I doing in oh my, my life? You know? <laughs> when you're doing stand up over in Europe, how does that yeah. translate? Yeah, because I mean, the, yeah, you kind of have to know the English language a little bit to yeah. understand some of the jokes. Yeah, I, you know, and I didn't speak any language, any, any other languages, German, nothing. Uh, the closest I came was I was in Italy, and I spoke a little bit of Spanish, and they were okay with it. Like, <laughs> but, you know, but Italian, they, Spanish, you get, it's all the inflections, oh, you know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> but did they get your jokes? Did they understand Oh, yeah, anything? it was great. Yeah. We, had, we had lots of fun, and yeah, it was just, it was amazing. Was, we did nine countries in 28 days. Wow. It was just That's amazing. That's nuts, wow. living that way. Yeah, yeah, it was, uh, it was up every morning. Was what, do you, what do you do with your mail? <laughs> gone to that one time, like, who's opening your mail and paying exactly. your bills? I, I came up with a lot of late fees. It was, uh, <laughs> <laughs> it was a lot of voicemails. Oh, Mr. Malone, we've been trying to get a hold right. of you. Like, yeah, I was, I was out of the country. Yeah, whatever. So we, we said you're doing more film, because I think the yes. last time we chatted, it was you know more than a year ago probably yeah. now, but you had a couple of films that were yeah, on the verge Chopping of coming Block. out. Uh, Chopping Block was coming out. Uh, my film, uh, I shot a film and uh, got to direct it and, and star in it called Bethlehem. Him. Mm -hmm. And it, uh, we, uh, it's a Christmas film. It's like, I always say it's a holiday film for adults. There's no kids, there's no singing. It's, it's just uh, drinking and hating your family, you know? <laughs> like Christmas it's is like, supposed to be. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's the, everybody who sees it goes, that's my family. Uh -huh. How did you get my family right. on the screen? Um, so it, it's a great little film, and it's in the festival market right now. We actually took home uh, Best Picture and three separate festivals, we got Best Cast. That's um, awesome. So it's, it's just been doing really well. So it's not so. out yet for release. It's still no, no, yeah. you can see it, um, you can watch it online at uh, BethlehemTheMovie.com, mm -hmm. and so we're, uh, you know, trying to sell it's it to gotta a It's got to be, uh, you, you got to be super proud. If you were starring in yeah. it or something, that's one thing, but then when you, you've got these other roles, like you're directing it, and it really yeah. becomes And it was the first personal. time directing kind of thing and, and all that stuff, and so it was, it was a lot to take on, but it was so much fun, and, mm -hmm. and I can't wait to get behind the camera well, You're so busy, you're doing this, uh, this web series. What punched up is what it's called. Yeah, punched up. It's like a, um, it's a different kind of podcast. What I noticed in comedy, like a lot of times, it's just two hours of two people talking, and it's like, you know, I, I love Mark Maron, I love the the podcast, but how how long do I have to listen to him about his cats, <laughs> you know, for for an hour? <laughs> you know, it's like I get it. Uh, so I, I I'm interested in the story, you know, and so I, I'm a big fan of like uh, Radio Lab and Serial and This American Life, those kind of storytelling shows. And so what I did is I took those two ideas and kind of put them together. So I interview comedians, but then I add in uh, music and sound bits, and I put in live performance and all that stuff. So it really brings you into the story. Mm -hmm. uh, like this week I had Jim Short on, and he's talking about oh, doing... Oh, uh, like Jim. Jim's great. Yeah. And he's talking about doing Conan O'Brien, A Late Night with Ferg. I mean, he's done everything. Mm -hmm. And he talks about doing Letterman, and when he talks about these clips, I actually bring in the music and the sound. You hear David introduce him and all that stuff. So it really wow. puts you in that, in that mode. Well, it sounds really full for a podcast. Yeah, you know, not very long. They're like 10 mm -hmm. to 15 minutes. I just focus on that story. So and, where do we get it? Uh, you can get it on iTunes. You can get it on punchedup.com. Mm -hmm. um, Just go to iTunes and punch in your name. And yeah, yeah, pretty much. It'll come up. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. A couple times I've been distracted by your hair. <laughs> <laughs> I lost focus on what you're saying. Mind How do you do this? I mean, that's amazing. Can, you can you turn to the side so they can see your profile? Yeah, uh, this way and then this way. That's amazing. I got it. Yeah, it's... Um, what do you put in that? Is it a paste? Uh, what do everything. You put in I put that? everything in this. <laughs> <laughs> you just have everything in the bathroom. You just toothpaste, whatever. You just put it in. You're like, all right, looks good. Let's go. It's a good go. hair day. Is yeah. that what I, your definition might be a little bit different than most? Right. I had a woman at uh, Subway the other day. She goes, uh, she goes, is your hair supposed to be like that? <laughs> I was like, I don't know. You're supposed to work on a subway at 46? <laughs> we all make decisions, okay? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, this is mine. <laughs> um, are, you, are you 34? 33. Three. Yeah. So yeah. on your website, um, it says young-ish. Young-ish. What define young-ish? You know, I'm I'm getting I'm sorry I've been, I've been tweeting you know uh, different things like uh, you know I'm getting to this age where it's like uh, oh god what happened the other day I was so 
oh, something happened I was so excited about. Oh, my buddy, uh, <laughs> I was at my buddy's house, and he goes, uh, check this out. He turned on his oven fan, and he goes, listen how quiet that is. <laughs> and I was like, wow, I was like blown away. In my 20s, right. if you were to show me an oven fan, I would have right. oh. slapped you in your face. Like, what are you showing me an oven fan? That's so I'm fun. at that age now where I'm like, wow, that is impressive. so quiet. Where did you get that? I'm like asking questions, I'm involved. It's, it's terrible. It's like an out-of-body experience. Yeah, it is. Like, who extent. am I? Right. I got a buddy who just built a house and he put in the bathroom fans. They're like $1,200 fans and they're so quiet. You can't yeah. hear it. I was, yeah, we're so blown away by it. It's just amazing. Uh, uh, Michael Malone, you've got five shows between yeah. tonight, tomorrow, and then one on Sunday. Day. The number to call to get tickets is 402-493-8036. We call it the Bone Phone. They call it the Bone Phone. That's why we do. And then online, <laughs> it's funnybonomaha.com. Thank you, Michael. Wow, thanks for having me. Yeah. Yeah. We, we love having you here. It's always great. Michael! Michael, yeah. Kevin was yelling at you. On this day in 18.